Before we say goodbye again, my thanks to Jerry Lewis for sitting still for an extended interview on this program. And as I said at the outset of our broadcast uh, tonight, uh, beginning on October the 11th, Saturday night, we'll open up a whole new live venture from New York City, from Studio 8H here at Rockefeller Center. And we just happen to have the producer of the program, Mr. Lauren Michaels, with us, the producer of Saturday Night, and members of his company, and let's spend a couple of minutes talking about your show. Lauren, I'd like to meet your gang. Well, but just before we do that, I just want to say that I thought Jerry was wonderful as well. Um, <laughs> che this is Chevy Chase. Uh, nice to meet you, Tom. Well, well, were, you oh, oh, were you named after the town in Maryland, or is that your real That's name? That's my real name. <laughs> 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 no, it is my real name. In fact, uh, I was named that two days after I was born. But we don't want to stay on that, do we? No, we certainly don't. It's going absolutely <laughs> nowhere. <Aykroyd. laughs> this is the beauty of live. You can move right on. Yes. Uh, Dan, Dan Aykroyd. Aykroyd. Hello, Dan. Hi. Hi, Dan. Jane Curtin. Hi, Jane. Jane. Uh, it's Garrett Morris. What's Garrett? happening? Gilda Radner. Gilda. Mm -hmm. John Belushi. And, uh... Lorraine Newman. <laughs> Lorraine Newman. <laughs> it's all right. Will all of you be seen every week doing improv, a repertoire, or how, how does it work? Well, we've got eight, and we're hoping for two to really work. <laughs> so not all of these people will become stars. I mean, I, that's I what I said. That only two of you will be chosen Probably just to appear two on the program. Or, so the rest of yeah. you are just spinning your wheels. Is that what I mean? <laughs> Essentially, <laughs> yes. No, I, I, almost everybody. Well, I don't want to. It could be embarrassing. <laughs> you don't hurt us now. Uh, I think I can say without fear of uh, contradiction that I will be working every week <laughs> as one of these stars on the show. Now, Danny here, who's a funny fellow in his own right, will be on once in a while when we work his contract out. <laughs> The rest of the company here are uh, all very good improvisational actors, and uh, they'll probably be on too. We've done a tremendous amount of work already, and uh, we're we'll be on the, live. We're ready. We to were go. in the studio all day today and uh, all day yesterday. What'd you do? We're still trying to figure out how they get the people in the little box. That's the only problem so far. But it's uh, it's very um, it's a nice building to be working in. This place. I mean, it's Rock Center uh, is uh, a nice Rock uh, Center. Yeah, <laughs> it's uh, so clean. The air conditioning needs to do toning down. <laughs> no, no, the heat was turned down in the building here two weeks ago, and that heat stays on until June fifteenth, <laughs> because there's a memorandum which was written in stone downstairs a couple of years ago, and it says, "Thou shalt turn the heat on September fifteenth. Thou wilt not turn the heat off until." A June 15th. Oh, that explains it. Right. That explains And then uh, in June, the guys come in on the treadmill and the fans start going up and down. It gets a little cooler in the building. I want to ask you about what you've all done before, whether you got the jitters about doing a live show for an hour and a half, but I got to stop here for just about two minutes and five seconds and we'll be right back. Just a couple of minutes here with the gang from Saturday Night, which premieres here on NBC at 11.30 on the 11th of October. Lauren Michaels is the producer. Now, your first host is George Carlin. George Carlin, man, who yes, probably Gary. will say the seven words which cannot be said on television. Huh? Uh, live, yeah. That, yeah. Uh, there is a six-second delay, but uh, some of those words have eight or nine letters, so uh, <laughs> you never know. One of these says, watch Saturday Night Live with Howard Cosell. Now, that's the six words you ought not say. Huh? Well, I watched the Cosell show the other night, and I... Uh, Great. Didn't like it at all. No, I, I liked it uh, quite a lot, actually. I was actually quite happy that there was a show coming from New York. Me too. I think that there's different stuff in New York. What should we look for on your program? Uh, anxiety. Uh, <laughs> I, yeah. <laughs> uh, the first show, uh, George's guests are Janice Ian and uh, George's guest, I'm turning into an announcer. Uh, joining George will be Appearing uh, with George Janice, tonight. I exactly, will be Janice Ian and Billy Preston and uh, Albert Brooks has done a short film which is very funny. Uh, the Muppets, of, uh, Jim Henson has uh, Put together a new batch, a, a, a whole new group of Muppets, which are adult Muppets and who can uh, stay up late. <laughs> and uh, we have, geez, there must be something else on that show. I mean, uh, these people uh, will be on, and uh, yeah. well, of course, there's we'll the probably not look anything. Like we've been we've been taping all day. We're kind of a we've been taping bush. a bunch of commercial parodies yeah. uh, the past fun. Those uh, are fun, yeah. past two days in the studio and. Uh, um, when you have 18 minutes of commercials in your time period, then it's to not comment on, on uh, commercials uh, would be ridiculous. So we put them in just before the actual commercials. Well, so. it all starts on the 11th of October, and I wish you all well and have a lot of fun, and the audience will too, and uh, welcome to Rockefeller Center and doing live television from the Thank you. I think it's great. Thanks. 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 We will continue and tell you about Monday night's effort at 1 o'clock in the morning right after these events.